good evening everyone i hope uh, good afternoon rather i hope you all can hear me let's have this session in discussion form rather than having a lecture form i repeat we will be having this session in discussion form rather than having the session in lecture form this is not my problem this is not your problem this has become a social problem dummy school why dummy school why bachchan are moving to dummy school you all must have seen the circular issued by cbsc only last night action taken on some schools so let's uh, have this uh, session in discussion form um if you all can introduce yourself in one minute one not one minute or 12 that means your name your city and at what role you are working at what you are a teacher or you are some administrator or something miss komal jain komal jain can you hear me unmute yourself unmute yourself miss komal jain please unmute yourself yes sir good evening yes sir this is komal from palladium school hisar sir okay you are working as a teacher yes sir, yes, sir. i am okay. pgt commerce there sir okay okay thank you mantra mahuja mantra mahuja deepak gupta My good hand. evening sir good evening sir uh, mansha this side yes sir i'm working as a teacher in a school model school ambedkar chowk okay. rohtak okay very good radhika radhika i phone somebody with the name radhika. my humble request if you will keep your uh, video on it will help me also and you also hello very good afternoon good afternoon this is radhika i'm working in a school as a tgt english okay thank you ma'am thank you very much sir uh, then we have miss rashmi jain good evening everyone i am rashmi jain from bal bharti school manesar working as pgt economics thank you ma'am uh, mr ramesh yadav hola namaskar sir namaskar sir ramesh yadav kendri vidyalay new kent thank you so you yeah, are working right. as a teacher or you are working at some yeah. administrative post sir, yeah, sir. teacher sir teacher. Okay. thank you uh, then we yeah, have uh, oh, shrest okay. dubey yeah. mr shrest yeah. dubey yes sir yes please introduce yourself from which city you are and at what post you are my name is shrest dubey and i am uh, studying in class 10 in crp public school you are a uh, student you are a student no i have now passed on to class 11 okay so bachcha this, this is this is not for you this is not for you this session But is I'm for class you. 11 right now. okay so i am removing you this session is not for you bachcha okay and then uh, i don't know how the uh, ram rakhi bothra राम राखी बोथरा गुड आफ्टरनून सर गुड आफ्टरनून आई एम फ्रॉम सूरत और टीचिंग इन भगवान महावीर इंटरनेशनल स्कूल एज अकाउंट्स फैकल्टी ओके थैंक यू मैम थैंक यू आई थिंक समबडी एनीवन लेफ्ट वन मैम अर्च रश्मि जी ने वीरेंद्र सिंह या गुड आफ्टरनून सर गुड आफ्टरनून वीरेंद्र दिस साइड यस and you are from which school and working at what role yes i am a principal in uh, dr devraj singh public school thank you Ilab. sir thank you very much for joining it's our pleasure that you have joined we can have your input in the session uh, miss archana mathur yeah good evening sir i am uh, archana mathur from ambala kant i am a former principal and uh, now i'm working as a freelance uh, trainer for teachers with the uh, publishers oh, thank you ma'am thank you very much for joining it is our pleasure that you have joined thank so you, i hope i have taken an introduction of everyone if somebody has been left so we will take at a later stage let's start this session with this hot question uh, by which everyone is affected in the society whether it is parent student teacher school itself education as a whole everybody is affected with this question 
Now, uh, if we go through the detail of why dummy school, before that, we should be going why not dummy school. Whenever uh, I am generally being called to different schools and I'm going to different school guiding the parents that you should not be choosing dummy school. You, the school have different advantages. You should, your bacha should be continuing regular school instead of dummy school. That is my role when I'm going to school. What are the, what is the role of school? Now, if child go to school, there is some social interaction. First thing which is required is social interaction. After that, discipline. Well, once the child is in school, now, there is a proper discipline which child follows. And in college, in coaching centers, in other part of society, that discipline we cannot expect even and that is not required. So learning of discipline happens in the school. Now, there is a chain of command which child get to know who is my class teacher, who is my subject teacher, who is my coordinator, who is my principal. If I'm not satisfied by the, any action, any word, any uh, thing of my subject teacher, I have to approach to my class rep or to my headmistress. Or if I'm not satisfied with even with the headmistress, I have to approach to the principal. There is some chain of command. That is not because of that uh, has been made some hierarchy. That is for the learning process because whenever child will be entering into the society or into the corporates he or she is supposed to follow a chain of command in the life that is very much important and which child can know learn only in the school another is teamwork in school uh, we have a lot of activities, some annual functions, some sports day, some different, different things where there are teamwork, which where bacha are supposed to learn the team activity. And uh, due to these team activities, a definite quality or a definite, uh, uh, what we get of shape is, uh, of the child is being built up, his mindset is built up, how he is supposed to work in a team. What things he has to keep in mind, how to behave, when to initiate, when if other is doing something, how to do, how to behave in that situation, how to respect the every member of the team. Another is a lot of activities are there in the school, which is not possible at all in coaching centers or if child joins some dummy school, the activities, child will not be able to do those activities. Then emotional connect. In the school, the school principal, the teacher, the bacha uh, with each other do have emotional connect, which helps a lot in the growth of the child, which is not possible. That emotional connect is not there at all in any of the coaching center. And in the dummy school, because the child is not going at all to the school, he is only registered in the school. That is the reason that emotional connect is not possible. And you know, you must have heard about a lot of cases of suicide and all which is happening out nowadays. That is due to some emotional connect, lack of that emotional connect. Again, alumni connect. Once you are in the school, you get a base of alumni. I know many of my friends who are working nowadays with their startups, with their companies, and they are having a lot of orders. They are having a lot of business. They are having a lot of fun with their alumni, with whom once upon a time they have studied in the school. That alumni connect is not possible if child have joined some dummy school. Alumni, uh, if you have a strong alumni base in the school, it helps a lot, both for the growth of the school and for the growth of the child. And another thing is respect of individuality. Every child have his or her unique quality. The respect for that individuality is possible only in school, not in coaching centers at all. Because in coaching centers, people work uh, on group. We are working on a group. Out of that group, somebody will perform, somebody will not perform. 
and those will perform i will put the banner of those people next year and next group will come again few people will perform few people will not perform those who will perform again i will put the banner of those people on and next batch will come that happens in the coaching centers but this is not the situation or in a school every child's individuality is respected in the school that is generally uh, is expected from the school that is generally happens in the school and that is the why we educator tell all the bachcha all the parent not to go to dummy school or coaching centers i'm not saying the bachcha should not be going to coaching center they can go to saturday sunday evening classes and all those things depending upon the requirement but not leave school after 10th and get themselves registered in dummy school that is generally we tell to the parents but the story starts the background which we have to introspect we educators we teachers we the ed school administration have to introspect let's go one by one you all must be happy going through the news uh, circulated only yesterday that these 23 schools has been has been suspended or we can deaffiliated by cbsc by cbsc by, for running as a dummy school three of them has been degraded and 20 of them has been deaffiliated this circular is of 22.32024 CBSC. You must have find the news in every newspaper today. You should be happy that even CBSC is working on that. But work, if uh, you not start introspecting yourself, this will not help you at all. It, this problem will come with another way. People will start getting arrested in the government schools. I And that trend has started. I'm telling you, I have seen the trend have started. There is a lot of pressure in the uh, public school. They will not work as a dummy school. Then, Bachaj will get re themselves registered in government school where neither teacher teacher are not there at all or i will not say that neither teacher are coming there are many good school government school where teachers are coming but there is no teacher in the school there is one teacher two teachers nobody is even taking the attendance of the bachcha bachcha will not go to school again the same problem will exist in some other way i have seen some of the school i will not name coming the coaching centers the coaching centers and in Gurgaon, the biggest coaching center of India have started this year only, this year only, with a, a CBSC affiliated school. They have started a school with other name. They are coaching center, but they have started school. Now, how CBSC will work? They have started school, they will start teaching there only. So this problem cannot be solved from CBSC end. Please try to understand. CBSC cannot solve this problem at end. If CBSC, if, yes, please. Uh, if CBSC start uh, getting the solution for this, this problem will come from other way. Other way, the same problem will exist. We have to introspect what we as an educators are supposed to do. I hope uh, you all are getting what I am uh, telling you. Now, moving to my next slide. Please uh, try to select. I want answer from each one of you, starting from uh, Miss uh, Anj Anjali Rai. There are two set of colleges you can see on the screen. Set A is where IIT, IM, NLU, DU, and set B, BHU, JNU, AMU, Punjab University, and all. These are the excellent colleges, universities of India. Excellent. But let tell me in which set of these two you generally miss your child should be going. Miss Anjali. Anjali Rai. What we prefer generally 
more people will prefer. Oh, you can write in the chat box. All of you, please, my humble request, write in the chat box. Set A is IIT, IIMs, NLUs, DU. Set B is BHU, JNU, AMU, PU. In which set, generally, people prefer that the child of your own child should be going. Please, I'm waiting for the answer. I'm going to read the chat box. A, Mr. Ramesh Yadav has written A. I can read some of the answers, please. Very good, very good. Virendra uh, has written A. Deepansi has written A. Okay. Uh, Ram Rakhi Bhotra has written A. Very good. Okay. Uh, Rasmi Janam has written A. Very good. Uh, again, uh, uh, Ashina ma'am have also written uh, some colleges of A, then she has introduced one of B also, no problem, it's okay. Okay, I should respect A, A. Maximum of you have written A. Why A? Try to understand why A. If you get to know why A, the problem will be solved. Why we join a college or a bacha join college and after the college, the result is the job. Result is the job. The college which will be giving job, employment to the child, bacha will be willing to go there. The college or the university which gives you the better future prospect, bacha will go there. Parents will choose that college, course, university, over other college course and university, which are excellent in nature, JNU is excellent in nature, BHO is excellent in nature, AMU is excellent in nature, Punjab University is having better ranking than uh, uh, Delhi University in, if you see the education ranking all over the world, Punjab. But whether they are giving the same opportunity in terms of employment, in terms of future prospect, if not, that is the reason bachcha are going to set A college instead of set B college. Same way, you have to think about the school. When a child is in the school, what is the outcome? Outcome is the college. Which school helps the child to get into good college? That is your outcome. If you can help the child to reach IITs, IIMs, NLUs, DUs, the bacha will be get attached with you. If you cannot help the child to reach these colleges, bacha will not be get attached with you. I am getting a lot of messages every day. Sir, my name is some, uh, today only I got a message from a Gurgaon school, bacha. my name, my, I'm from South India, so my title is this, my name is this. In the Aadhaar card, first is my title, second is my name. And in my mark sheet, first is my name, say, uh, first name and then my title. What should I fill in CUT form? Another question, sir, I'm willing for become honest. What should be my subject? Another question, sir, well, I, I, I do not have OBC certificate. It should be the state one or the center one. This type of thing. Why these bachas are not calling the school teachers? Try to understand. Try to understand. If you are getting these type of queries from your bachas these days, you are doing excellent and you are helping them. You are able to help them. You are not saying, no, but I do not know. Take this number, call on this number. No. If you are able to help the child, child will be get connected with you. If you are not able to do this, then child will search for other option. Now, these coaching centers, those dummy schools which are attached with some coaching centers, they have full phrased full phrased mechanism where people are sitting and guiding these bachas. I was with the coaching center yesterday only. I have a session tomorrow with them. Um, I'm working in the industry as a whole. I see they have counselors sitting there guiding each and every bacha at each and every step. But uh, if during the form you face this problem, this is the solution. They are coming with the small, small videos. Step one, what to do, step two, what to do, step three, what to do in CUT form. Okay. 
in IIT form. If they are helping, try to understand if I have a problem, I need solution. If you can give me solution, I will be with you. If you cannot give me solution, I have to search for other option. This is not that you know uh, you are doing very good work. So I will know what is my problem. Problem is going into every child who is coming in class 11th. Please try to understand. The problem of that child is only one. Reaching to the good college. If during your 11th and 12th, you can help the child to reach to a good college. Your work is done. If you cannot help, you are saying, no, we will teach you to get 100 out of 100 in accountancy or 100 out of 100 in business study. Please try to, uh, try to understand. Child is getting 100 or child is getting 95. It will not affect at all. You know there is NEET, there is JE, there is CUET, there is CLAT. How it will affect? You can put a big board somewhere in front of the school that we have given this marks. How it is going to help the child? Why a child should be putting effort? Let me move to the next slide. Try to understand the, understand the cause of the problem. Is this coaching center due to which bachas are not coming to school and going to dummy school? Please write yes or no. Please, in the chat box, I am waiting for. This is the problem of dummy school is due to coaching centers. Yes or no. Please, I am waiting for the answer. There are 15 people. I want 15 yes or no or combination of that. Whatever you feel. Yes, yes. Somebody has written yes, yes. Very good, very good. Okay. Okay. Second is child. Who do not want to study? This is the cause. Yes or no? Please write yes or no. Yes or no? I'm waiting for yes or no. The problem is due to coaching center or the problem is due to child. If it is okay, then third, I'm moving again to the third cause, which is no weightage to board marks. Is this the cause? Please. One is coaching center. Two is child. Three is no weightage to marks. And let me give you the fourth option also. Fourth option also. Fourth option is fourth option is the parent are not supporting. Out of these four, write one, two, three, four. Please. I am waiting for the answer. One, two, three, four. I am reading your answer. What is the cause? I am reading the answers. One, two, three, four. You can write like that also. One and two. Two and three. Okay, one, two, three. Four. So, Archana Mathur ma'am has written one and two. Uh, Deep, uh, Deepansi Singh ma'am has written one and four. Okay, very good, very good. Uh, I am waiting for other... Uh, I am waiting for the other's response. Okay. Uh, Mantram Ovija 3 and 1. Okay. Very good. Very good. I am waiting for the answers before proceeding. Okay. Anjali Rai, I have written 1. Uh, Ramesh Yadav sir has written 1 and 4. Virendra Singh has written 1 and uh, 4. Okay. Very good. Okay. Let me tell you. One, two, three, four. These are irrelevant at all. You will not uh, understand. Do you think there are no coaching center for cat and all or all those things? But bachas are going to the school, studying the school, and fighting, fighting for getting admission into those colleges whose marks does not matter at all. Whatever the marks you get into BCom honors in SRCC, maybe 10% more or 10% less, will not affect your admission into IMS. You have very good CAT ranking. You have very good performance in the interview. Your purpose will be solved. Then why bachas 
are taking admission in SRCC even after this. Why bachchan are taking admission in LSR? Try to understand problem is somewhere else. We are not able to recognize the problem is at fourth place. If you start blaming, no, start give weightage to the board. I can tell you problem is B, V at school. Teachers, school, management, administration, that this is the fifth is the problem. If we understand this thing, problem is not giving board weightage to the mark. That means we are so thinking, oh, weightage will be given, but will automatically come. This is called as some called was the, this is not democracy. If you perform, if you give, try to understand, or there, there are a lot of degree colleges throughout India. They do not have any, any weightage of their marks in the IS exam or SSC exam or uh, railway exam, but bachas are willing to take admission to get that degree. To They are giving examination every year, every semester of that college to get graduate from there. If you say, oh, they, they, their university do not have any, any weightage of their marks in IS examination, they will not be coming to the college. No, it is not happening at all. Bachas are going to those colleges. Bachas are going to those colleges. There is something else which is missing. We have to understand. Bachas are, even today, I can tell you, in Gurgaon itself where I am living, there are schools which are organizing entrance for class 11th and there are lines on a particular Saturday, school have only 110 seats for class 11th and there are 500 bachas who are filling the form and willing to take admission in class 11th in that school. Why? Try to understand the problem is something else. Problem is not coaching center. If coaching center is a problem, the other school which are having this entrance test will also have the problem. If no weightage to marks is the problem, same problem will be there with those schools also. Problem is something else. Try to understand. Let me go through that. We are saying, bachas should be coming to school, bachas communication skills will be improved, bachas uh, social skills will be improved, bachas interaction will be improved, with that all we, I discussed in my slide number two. But I am asking you five questions. Please, my humble request, it will be good if you all can switch on your camera and give me the answer of these five questions. These five questions, you will get the answer of this problem. One child who is admitted in class one in an English medium school after class 10, do you, do you say that I take guarantee that any child who have studied from my school for 10 years will be able to speak fluent English. Or maybe Hindi, if it is a Hindi medium school, fluent Hindi, he can write one page very good Hindi, he can write very good English, he can speak very good English. Do you guarantee this? If a child have taken admission in your school in class one, and sometime even in nursery and KG, and after 10 years, child is not able to speak properly, what the English teacher of the school is doing? And if you say we have done our thing best and child should be coming to the school for overall development in the school, what overall development which you have not done in last 10 years will be doing in the next two years? Tell me, Ashina ma'am, do you think problem is where? Do you think that the, pro the development which have not been done in last 10 years or 11 years, if a child taken admission in nursery and KG, will be done in class 11th and 12th? Is it possible? No, sir. Where, who is at fault? It's the teachers and it's the, the teachers. in the management. Every, yeah, because it he, is uh, the, as in, a... that English medium school who have very qualified teachers teaching from nursery to till 10th, they have not ensured that this child who have joined this English medium school will be able to at least speak properly 10 sentences, 12 sentences, standing somewhere and can speak in proper manner. That has not been ensured. 
what type of overall development the school is doing what type of overall development the school is doing and which will be done in next two years which has not been done in last 10 years think you will get the solution of the problem why bacha is not willing to take admission in class 11 you will get you will say no their parents are not speaking in english then why how can we ensure if their parents are not speaking english they will not be speaking english in class 11th and 12th also <laughs> then why bacha should come to the school if the parent of the child have no, uh, is not speaking english in the at home they will not be speaking English in 11th and 12th also. What you are doing, going to do? That means school is not helping so-called overall development of the child, which we are thinking that we will tell that coaching center will not do, we will do, please come to school, do not go to coaching center. If we are able to do that, the problem will be solved. Let me move to the another problem. I have seen social skills, decision-making skills, which uh, I have discussed in my slide number two. In last 10 years, from class one to class 10, are you able to do that? Rasmi, ma'am, I hope we were discussing this problem only yes, two sir. days back. I remember that. If child have not if the school have not ensured, if the teachers have not ensured, in last 10 years, the child have joined the school, why what what magic you will be doing in two years and ensuring mr virendra sir please tell me do you think the problem is somewhere which we have not done in last 10 years that bacha can take as a tangible that this have school have ensured in 10 years and which can be increased by 20 percent in next two years which will not be done if i join some coaching center as a dummy school do you think problem is here somewhere? Yes, yes, of course, sir. Yes, this is the real problem. And this I'm telling on the basis of my research, I'm going, going uh, approx uh, 20 or not 20 to 15 schools every month. Every month I'm going and I'm seeing the same problem. Now, I'm giving you another thing. Let's go for the mathematics part. Do you think a child who have joined your school in class 11th is not your responsibility? Is class 8th not your responsibility? But the child who have joined your school in nursery KG class 1. As a accounts teacher, I have seen but child is not able to calculate profit, loss, interest, discount. If I say that the goods is of 500 rupees, a 20% discount, what will be the price of it? Bacha is not able to do that. Bacha is not able to do simple interest, simple uh, compound interest, uh, what a ratio proportion, these all things Bacha is not able to do in 10 years. Simple mathematics. Now tell me what mathematics teacher of the school have done from class 1 to class 10. The mathematical ability, the problem solving, the critical thinking, we talk a lot about all these things. And we say, no, Bacha is not having mathematical aptitude. If Bacha do not have mathematical aptitude, Bacha will not be having the mathematical aptitude in next two years also. Why Bacha should be coming to your school then? So please, the simple thing, when we used to study, Acha batana to 20 ka dhai guna kitna hota hai, aur hum kehte te 20 ka dhai guna 50 hota hai, ek baar. Without doing that, our teacher used to train us in that manner. We at school nowadays, Solving some, some questions, but are attempting. I have seen my kids going to so-called very big schools <laughs> and I have seen the same problem in my kids also. It is not you or me. Everywhere it is happening. Then why Bacha should be continuing next two years also in the school? Are you giving something tangible to the child? If you are not giving something tangible to the child and saying that ki parents are not cooperating, but child do not have aptitude, but child is uh, uh, working throughout the mobile phone, going through the reels and all, that but child will be doing next two years also. What you can do in that situation? If you can do something in that situation, child will come to you. Next problem, let me go through another problem. There are some teenage-related issues with the bachas. One, the bacha 
has come to class 9, 10th, 11th, 12th. Are the teachers qualified, experienced enough to solve those problems? Are Pachas discussing those problems with the teacher and teachers are helping them? Sometimes gents teachers are not talking, uh, girl teachers, even the lady teachers are sending them to the some medical room or some uh, counselor in the school. Why? No, this is a very basic problem. Happens at every house. As a parent, as a parent, as I guide my daughter, my son, at home, I have to guide the bachcha in the school. If I am efficient enough, qualified enough, experienced enough to solve this type of problem, bachcha will be in the school. And if I am not able to do this, bachcha will not be into the school. Let me go through the another. I have seen, I have faced, I am going through this situation. A lot of bachcha nowadays who are filling their CUT form, who are filling their CLAT uh, form a few months back, who are filling their JE form, who are filling their NEET form, who are doing that, they are facing a lot of problem. A lot of problem. Problem related. Today I got a call from, sir, what is this APAR number? Why I, get, I, I as a counselor are getting this problem? Why? The first person who should be getting this call should be the class teacher of that bacha. Whosoever is the bacha, whatsoever is the school, the first person, do you have that connect with that bacha? And are you experienced enough? Have you done any effort to know what is the par number? And if the child do not have a par number, how he or she should be proceeding in these forms? Because these are the very basic things. You should be knowing what are the forms, what are the litigities, what are the qualifications required, what are the colleges. Do you know as a commerce teacher, which is the best college for finance, which is the best college for marketing, as a science teacher, what are the courses, colleges available in your field, as a humanity teacher, what are the career options, whether the deadlines. Do you know all these things? If you do not know all these things, child will contact someone else. And if child will contact someone else and that person will be helping at every stage to the child, why child should be coming to school? Do you think that you are teaching business study or economics or physics or chemistry and that solves the problem? That happens in 2000 rupees with the videos available on YouTube nowadays. 2000 rupees and the best videos are available with the best educational group. Then why bacha should be wasting time? Somebody was asking me only a few days back, sir, the coaching centers are doing some picnic party, birthday party, and bachas are going there, not coming to school. I'm telling you that even after doing that birthday party, picnic, and all those things, they are able to manage their syllabus. They are able to give better result as compared to you in the school. Then why the bachas are going thrice in a week there, bacha is coming five days in a week to the school. Then why bacha should be wasting time in the school? So please try to understand we have to solve these problems at our level to attract bacha in the school. If we are able to help parent and child in the school. I am giving you guarantee. Today is Saturday. You go to the centers of Career Launcher, IMS, Pratham, Fitji. These are the excellent institutions. I'm not advertising any of them. But you may be seeing a lot of parents sitting there. And the counselor, teachers sitting there will be helping these bachas in filling their forms. In filling their forms of the career which bachas at this point of time after their course or due to their course are very much intense. But we as a teacher, oh, we have prepared for the board, our work is done. If our work is done, bachas will not come to the school. Not come to the school. They have to, they will be searching someone else. They will be searching someone else. I am moving to my next slide. Please try to understand <laughs> Child come to school due to uh, for some skills. Please do not have any boost of do not have uh, think I have done my physics 
uh, syllabus and my child got 50 marks or 100 marks in had so many bacha of physics got 100 marks so many bacha of accountancy got 50, 100 marks please this is of no use nowadays please try to understand this is of no use at all how much mark bacha is getting in the board and if you are having anything, please try to see the good schools which are coming. I have seen the schools I, sh I should not be naming. You please go to, uh, to Gurgaon City. There are schools which are coming pure education based. They are opening their branch. They are opening their branch. And in year two, they are having two, two, three, three, four, four sections. They are having neat teacher, J teacher paying 22 lakh, 3 lakh, 3, 4 lakh rupees per month to those teachers running those classes in the school and all seats are full. All seats are full. Because they know what is the requirement. If you do not know what is the requirement, Bacha should not be coming to you for your purpose. Bacha is coming to you for his or her own, his or her own purpose. What is the requirement of the child? We as a school, we as a teachers, our service provider, we have to give them the best service. We have to help the bacha while providing the best service. Only two days back, I have been called by a government school of Delhi. Please come to our school. We have so many girls. They do not know. Please sit with them and guide them how to fill their CUT form. And I was there. I helped them. Because they know, as a management of the school, the principal, they know what is the requirement. If they will not do this, next time the enrollment in that government school will reduce. So they know this is the requirement. They must have filled that. So you have to visualize what is the real problem. Unless until you visualize what is the real problem, problem cannot be solved by saying, no, this is happening due to the coaching centers. No, please. There are some skills for which bacha are coming to your school. You should be able to add those skills in the child. We talked about a lot. Think I can, I, I go to different teachers training program. We talk about a lot putting critical thinking in the child. Visualize. As a teacher, do I know what is critical thinking at all? <laughs> what is my communication skills? <laughs> what, what, I am able to collaborate with my accountancy teacher, with my economics teachers while teaching my business study. Do, have I developed any project in business study where my accountancy teacher have taught something else and I have taught something else and my two chapters, one of accountancy, one of business study have been completed. Have economics teacher have made any project? Not, I'm not talking about the CBSC project which where you are supposed to complete a project file and get 20% marks. Have you done some collaboration activities? Where you have sat with economics teacher, business study teacher, physics teacher, have sat with chemistry teacher and decided some activity or something, or thinking about collaboration, completing two topics by two teachers in such a manner. So that if you have not done why, how you are doing that activities at the school, you are saying we are doing collaboration. Adaptability, try to adopt. I have seen teachers fighting in front of the bacha. Oh, this is my period. Why you are taking this period? And we are trying to say we are teaching adaptability to the child. <laughs> Unless until we adopt adaptability in our behavior, in our working, we cannot teach adaptability to the child by saying these skills we are increasing. Creativity, think about, please try to think how you have taught XYZ chapter last year and what improvement you have done while teaching the same topic this year, if you have done some improvement, some creativity, some happiness in the class, some involvement of the bachas during your teaching and which should be better than the last year. Do you have 20 years of experience or you have one year of experience 20 times? You have to think about that. If you cannot think like this, you cannot add these skills to the bacha, not at all, not at all. Please, I have seen my daughter, I have seen my daughter who is in class eight while uh, 
having the, the lace of her shoes, putting that, her fingers are not working in that manner, I, the manner in which we, our fingers used to work. Because this skill, fine motor skills, I don't know okay, what PE teachers are doing, what class teachers are doing. I have not seen at all. Her, the grip the laces should be having while putting the lace is not there at all. I don't know what happened in the last 10 years. And this is not related to my daughter or my son. I have seen in many bachcha. Language skills, I already told you that neither bachcha is able to write English nor Hindi nor able to write, um, write or speak properly is after even after teaching 10 years in the school. And we are saying that we are doing everything and bachcha should be coming to class 11th in the school because bachcha overall development will be there. I think this uh, has been uh, written two times by mistake. Problem solving skills, then social skills again. Uh, please try to understand there are diverse nature, different type of bacha in the class. We do not sit with that child. This type of statement I have seen. Uh, I have worked as a senior coordinator in the school. I have seen this same situation. No, this child, you should not be sitting with that. Why? Why is social skill? Any bacha in the class, the skill you have to teach the bacha. This is not the solution. You will not sit with that child. This is not the solution at all. After sitting with that child, how I and the other child with whom I should not be sitting should be growing together. That skill a teacher have to add. Please never say any child do not sit with that child. Please never do that. This is a very shortcut method of solving the problem. Shortcut method, no, we should not be doing that. My humble request, this is not the way of solving the problem. So I, I'm giving you a few uh, things what as a teacher, as a school, we should be doing to attract more and more bachcha in class 11, 10, 12. Bachcha should not be going to dummy school. How? If we are able to work as a mentor, as an influencer, as a guide, as a facilitator, as a role model to the bachcha, bachcha will be in the school. I'm telling you, bachcha can become doctor, engineer, chartered accountant, whatever. But whenever you are going to the class, bachcha should be thinking, I have to become a human being like my this teacher. I will become doctor, I will become engineer, no, it's, it's okay. But I will become a human being. Insan mujhe aisa banna hai. If you can give this impression to the child, child will not be leaving the school. Not. Another thing, please, my humble request, whatever the subject you are teaching, whatever the subject you are teaching, please go through the detail of the college, courses, careers related to those subjects in detail and some of the common platform like CUET, like CLAT, like every which uh, any child can fill, please go through. Please, as a candidate, register yourself. Give 30 minutes. Open today CUET form. What is the first step? What is the second step? What is the third step? Start filling the CUET form at the time of end, end when you have to uh, pay the fees. Discontinue that. If you will fill the form, you will get to know what are the questions being asked in that form. Then only if a child will be calling you, ma'am, I am filling the CVT form, I am filling the CLAD form, I am filling the JE form, and I am facing this problem, what to do? Then only you can help the child. Please, my humble request, my humble request, please think about future. Do not think about today what you are teaching in a particular subject or a particular chapter. Think about future. If you start thinking about the future of the child in your subject, your work will be done. Another thing, please try to understand your child. His like, his or her like, dislike, skills, qualities, shortcomings. The more you know about your child, about child means the students which are in your class, in your subject, in your section, in your, your school. 
the better you will be able to help the child. Please try to understand more. Syllabus, uh, syllabus of the CBSC, generally we say syllabus is more. Please try to understand every year CBSC is reducing the syllabus. We are having same number of days, something that if syllabus has been reduced after Corona 30%. And even then we are we are there only to complete the syllabus. And how this coaching center wala is doing the same thing in some crash course or something like that in two months, three months, four months. We have to think, we have to visualize. If we can visualize that, if we can think that, our problem will be solved. <laughs> Last thing, uh, school must be thinking beyond syllabus and getting marks in the board. Beyond that, what we are doing with the child. That is important. There should be talk on that only. Child has got this much marks or we, this syllabus has been completed on this day. This is the very basic requirement which is expected from every teacher. If we are doing that and we are saying that we are good, no. This is a very basic requirement. Very basic requirement. That is very basic requirement. What beyond that we are doing? That we claim that we have done this today. Not that we have finished the syllabus, we have done this. Our children's 100 number came, two children's 100 came, we have done this. No, this is not. This is not we have done. What beyond that? I am sure, please, I want to know um, any query, any questions from all of you. I want your feedback of the session. Uh, what is the learning? It will be uh, my humble request. If you give your one-line feedback before leaving the session, uh, it will motivate me. It will help you. And we can continue this type of sessions in future also. I will start uh, with Mr. Virendra Singh, sir. Please, my humble request. How you find the session? And what <coughs> is the learning of this session today? Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Actually, uh, you picked a wonderful topic. Uh, this is a big challenge as an educator for us. Uh, right now, I recently joined this, this school. Uh, earlier, I was in Indra from public school crossing the Republic and uh, hardly 15 to 20 days I have uh, worked. I'm working there and I'm still working. And uh, we have started the process for cl class 11th uh, admission. And the maximum parents are uh, asking these questions. Ki, sir, what will happen if we will go with Rami? Because everyone want uh, either a doctor or want to become either doctor or engineer. So... Although we are trying to counsel the parents regarding this, but uh, this uh, this session really enriched us uh, a lot, and definitely we will put, uh, add someone, some some uh, some more uh, inputs and some more uh, 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 this thing concepts, and maybe we will try to convince them to go with the regular school. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, thank sir. Thank you, thank you very much, Miss Archana Mathur. Please, your inputs, please. Yeah, <clears throat> thank you, sir. Firstly, I want to compliment you for this wonderful session. And uh, I would like to say that, you know, you sort of reflected lots of things which I as a principal have been through, uh, though I'm not a principal anymore. And uh, one thing I want to share, and I hope it's not becoming a kind of a trend, uh, it's tuitions which start at the very basic level of uh, classes. You know, class nursery children, KG children are going for tuitions. Yeah. Is it okay? When I was in school, I'm a very ancient variety. I studied in the 80s. And uh, there were three children from my class who got selected for AFMC without any coaching. Mm -hmm. My own son in 2006 got selected for engineering without any coaching. So uh, why do children need coaching now? What are the teachers, like what you say, what are the teachers doing in school? So the problem is that we have so much tuitions pe itna depend karne lage, right from the very beginning, right from junior classes. So this And why is it happening? Because teachers want to earn extra money. School will not study in school, we will study extra money. Lenge. So I think this is the crux of the problem. Yes, ma'am. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you very much for your enriching word. Uh, Mr. Ramesh Yadav. Mr. Ramesh Yadav. Uh, Yes, sir, please. If you can share your feedback, guide us. It is sharing with each other. You can unmute yourself, sir. Sir, the problem is that the school is a dummy school. 
बस इससे हमें पता लग रहा है कि जो मेन प्रॉब्लम कहाँ है और हम लोग ठीक से नहीं कर पा रहे हैं वास्तव में स्कूलों में है ना मैं हम लोग बिजी रहते हैं अपना कोर्स पूरा कराने में कि कोर्स पूरा कर लें कोर्स पूरा कर लें उनके नंबर अच्छे आ जाए तो yes. हम लोग जैसे हमें समझ में आ रहा है इस तरह से हम लोग भी प्रयास करेंगे कि जो आपने गाइड किया है हम लोग भी उस तरह से सोच और चेंज करें अपने आप को ताकि बच्चे जमी स्कूल छोड़ के स्कूल में रहें थैंक यू सर थैंक यू वेरी मच सर थैंक यू सर ये मान लेना ना कि हाँ कमी हमारे में है अगर जिस दिन हमने ये मान लिया ना उस दिन सारी प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व हो जाएगी जब तक हम ये मानेंगे ना कमी समाज में है जैसे या कोचिंग सेंटर वाले ऐसा कर रहे हैं कोचिंग सेंटर जिस दिन हमने ये बांध लिया कि कमी हमारे में कहीं है प्रॉब्लम सॉल्व हो ठीक है कृष्णा श्रीवास्तव अनम्यूट प्लीज अनम्यूट योर सेल्फ मैम प्लीज अनम्यूट योर सेल्फ गुड इवनिंग सर कृष्णा श्रीवास्तव यस मैम प्लीज If you can introduce yourself, if you can introduce yourself, if you can introduce yourself, I am an English teacher at uh, DAV Public School, Pune. Okay. Coordinator as well. Uh, so this is something which we are really facing, and we are not getting admissions in eleventh. So that is why I wanted to attend this session. The reason behind it, and what you said is rightly state correct. The teachers haven't changed their way of teaching. So I wanted one session, especially where we could tell the teachers how to modify the lesson, how to improvise, so that the children are attracted towards. Especially for English, also I wanted. Okay, ma'am. So I have a, a seminar which I conduct with different school called a student teacher relationship. It is one hour workshop, which I do with different schools. So if you want, I can have it even online for your school whenever you want. So mm -hmm. which will be applicable for all subjects. How to teach. How to uh, completing syllabus is something else, and teaching is something else. Teaching means we up. have to add skills at every level. If a child, uh, you are English teacher, you know, but uh, child, if but child come into class saying no, no, knowing the basic of English, what I have added in class seven, what teacher have added in eighth, what teacher have added in ninth, that is should be visible, visible, tangible. If okay. that is tangible, your work is done. Completing syllabus, getting marks is not done. That is what the teachers focus on, especially physics, chemistry, maths. Yes. They focus on that only. And now, if there is going to be two pre boards next year onwards, then they are going to have shortage of time also. Ma so, time how... uh, again, I am telling you, time is not a problem. I have seen bachcha going to the coaching center. I I have worked with both. I was working with the school. I have was working with the coaching center. Many of you know. I have seen. Bachas coming to me. I am teaching accountancy three months enough to complete syllabus, do everything. Bachas coming to school even in the month of February. Some schools start their session in the February itself, or some in March. Board is there in March twelve month and syllabus, syllabus, syllabus. Laga hua hai. Correct. Problem is somewhere else. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we want. How to make it more interesting so that children are there in school or retained in school. Yes, ma'am. Certainly, ma'am. Certainly, we will work for that. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, Miss Dipansi Singh. Miss Dipansi or Ram. Yes, please. Dipansi, ma'am, please. Yeah. Good evening, sir, and good evening, everyone over here. Uh, the session was quite good because I got to know why. I mean, I mean, I'm not a teacher who is actually carrying like 20 years of experience. So I'm like more a newer person. I'm just carrying five years of experience. But still, I think uh, it's good to attain a lot of knowledge so that we can also guide our children. And we definitely do. So our children do not really need to go anywhere. But yeah, for their academic help, because of course, for any, uh, let's say, entrance like CLAT or any entrance like NEET or, I mean, if you're talking about JE, they, they do need the coaches because there is a I mean, vast difference between the syllabus of both of them. And one more thing, since, but, oh, since we were talking about this only, that the syllabus completion is not really a big problem. I really think it is because we do not just have teaching. If you're talking about teaching at tuition, you do not have anything else to do, right? But if you're teaching in a school, you do have a lot of events coming up. Like you have MUNs, you have your annual functions coming in, you have your weeks coming in, like English week or maybe some other week because I'm an English teacher, so I know that. And actually, we have plethora of activities that we do. So completing the syllabus in just three months i don't think is at all possible in tuitions and coachings it's easily possible because i also do the same i'm also a language trainer so i do it very easily in coachings it does not take class that is why we do have one month crash course or something called that 
So, okay. but in schools, I do not agree with that point. That is why I was. Okay, it's okay. It's okay, ma'am. I'm uh, agreeing with everything. Otherwise, is it was not, not, not uh, is required at all. Uh, do you think that when we are having our English week or M one or something that can some part of our syllabus be linked or organized in such a manner that is being done in that English week? Or something we are not supposed no, to complete. We are clearly guided by our principals. We are clearly guided by our principals and coordinators that we have to do something different from the curriculum. We cannot okay, be just going on and on about. I'm telling you. Suppose we you must be having your speech or debates or something. Right. Some maybe some part of grammar, some part of unseen passages or something like that, which we are supposed to do in curriculum, right. can be linked. I'm not telling you. I'm doing something else. But my that curriculum is automatically done. I'm able to understand, but that will become your worksheet, or that will become one of the assessments that you are taking for your uh, curriculum only. That's what we are not allowed to do. We are asked to okay. say, okay. ask the children to speak uh, the speech. Okay, thank you, thank you. I got it. Uh, Sharda Kathuria, ma'am, please. Sharda Kathuria. Rashmi, ma'am, your inputs, please. Yes, sir. thank you so much, sir. A very wonderful session. I understood the problem as well as the solution. And apart from syllabus, this time I will definitely understand the future uh, opportunities available and hope you'll guide me at every uh, uh, point. Of point. Thank, you. thank you very much, ma'am. Thank you very much for your kind words. Uh, Ms. So can Anjali I just Rai... add one more thing? Just yes, ma'am. Yes. Thing. Yes, ma'am, please. Just one thing. So we have to make our children understand something that they will never, ever become students again. So these golden years of school must be enjoyed in school. And if they go and join coaching centers, they will never get this opportunity back. Excellent like word, ma'am. I will catch one word. Yes. Must be enjoyed at school. Yes, sir. Are we, are we making our school in such a manner that bachcha really enjoying that? That is the thing. If yeah. bacha start enjoying, have bacha enjoyed in class 9th and 10th? If bacha have enjoyed in class 9th and 10th, bacha will be willing to come to 11th and 12th. If bacha have studied in class 9th and 10th, then bacha know we have to study. Then study can be done in coaching, study can be done in dummy school, study can be done at home by going through the videos and all. Exact word that enjoying. If we have and one more thing, uh, like you said, that teachers have to have a bond with their students. Yes. So today, after 40 years, you know, I have been out of school for 40 years now. And uh, we lost our teacher, one, our uh, class 12 class teacher, we lost last year. So you won't believe on the school's website. There were millions of messages in her honor because she was so dear to all of us. She was a wonderful person. And uh, from all over India, from other countries, I'm from CJM Dehradun, sir. Okay. So okay. Uh, that particular teacher, Mrs. Gill, she was idolized. And not just she, the, like, we have so much of respect for those ladies, even today, after 40 years of passing out. Ma'am, that is understood because as a, if you have left the school, you are no, no more with the school and still you are interested in the workshop like this, that shows your commitment. That shows your commitment to the profession. So if you people have, are having a Saturday, I know the Holy is uh, coming, you must be having a lot of work and you all have put up your one hour or one uh, and, and half hour for this workshop. That shows your commitment. But we have to make our industry in the same manner. Everybody in the school must be thinking in the same manner. And if we start something in that manner, our problem will be solved. Anyone else whose name has not been taken want to say something? Uh, before closing, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I want to say something. Yes, ma'am, please. Sir, in our surat, there is more of culture of coaching. Okay. The reason what I observe that I want to tell you, uh, see, in coaching, we have three hours per hour. Maximum three hours per coaching. We have to do subjects like BSC, economics, accounts, everything. And in school, we have six hours per hour. So they don't want to come over there. Three hours of our study is there. Why do they come here? Other activities, technique, uh, like activities, something else, farewell, they get to get coaching. Mein mil jata hai. So this is the time of our time. We have a lot of issues in school. Now this culture is 
चलो दमी ले लो कोचिंग में जाके आप कर लो तीन घंटे ही जाना पड़ेगा बाकी आप एंजॉय करो जो मर्जी है तो मैं यही मैं कह रहा हूँ कि जब वो तीन घंटे में तीन घंटे में जितना दे रहे हैं क्या हम छह घंटे में उसका दूना दे पा रहे हैं बस प्रॉब्लम यही है अगर वो तीन घंटे में जो भी आपने कहा उनका पिकनिक भी हो जाता है सब कुछ यू टोल्ड मी दिस थिंग कि वो तीन घंटे पढ़ा के भी ये सब कर दे रहे तो क्या हम छह घंटे पढ़ा के उनका डबल दे पा रहे हैं अगर हम दे पाएंगे तो बच्चे हमारे पास आएंगे और अगर हम छह घंटे पढ़ा के उतना ही दे पाएंगे जो वो तीन घंटे में दे रहे हैं या उससे भी कम दे पाएंगे तो बच्चे हमारे पास नहीं आएंगे यही तो प्रॉब्लम है ना और सेकंड सर ये डिसिप्लिन का भी इशू रहता है कोचिंग में उनको कोई कुछ नहीं कहता डिसिप्लिन का कोई इशू नहीं है बट स्कूल मैम ऐसा नहीं है मैं आपको बता रहा हूँ डिसिप्लिन एक ऐसा इशू है डिसिप्लिन हर जगह होता है कोचिंग सेंटर में भी ऐसा नहीं कि वो लड़ते थे हम क्या हम डिसिप्लिन किसको मानते हैं इसको हमें समझना पड़ेगा बच्चा कमिंग टू द स्कूल सिटिंग पार्टिसिपेटिंग बच्चा एक दूसरे से बातें करने लगे उसको हम इनडिसिप्लिन बोल दें तो वो डिसिप्लिन है ही नहीं बच्चा इफ देर आर बच्चा इफ एज ए टीचर वी सिट इन द क्लास रूम वी टॉक समाइम इट है कि बच्चा सिटिंग इन द क्लास एंड नेट टॉक एंड वी टेल दम इन डिसिप्लिन तो क्या हमें पता है कि डिसिप्लिन और इनडिसिप्लिन में डिफरेंस क्या है यस डिसिप्लिन लाइक इन स्कूल दे हैव टू कम इन यूनिफॉर्म विद टू पोनीटेल मैम आई आई कैन टेल यू देयर आर कोचिंग सेंटर्स लाइक आई डू नॉट नेम दे बच्चा आर गोइंग टू द मेट्रो इज हैविंग देयर टी-शर्ट हैविंग देयर बैग्स हैविंग देयर बॉटल्स एंड और दे आर बाउंड टू डू दैट तो ये ना वही मैं फिर बता रहा हूं अगेन हमें समझना पड़ेगा कि प्रॉब्लम कहीं और है this dress and all is not a problem at all not a problem do have we created some time of type of affection with our dress ki wo dress pehen ke bachcha proud feel kare maine is school ka dress pehna hai have we created that environment that is required anjali ma'am please you are you want to say something otherwise anjali ma'am yes ma'am हरियाणा रोहतक से बोल रही हूँ yes, हिंदी टीचर हाँ आपका ये पूरा सेशन बहुत ही फ्रूटफुल रहा और अभी मैम जो बात कह रहे थे तो वो आपके बात सही है कि हमें ही पहले सबसे ये समझना होगा कि डिसिप्लिन की परिभाषा क्या है डेफिनेशन हम क्या मानते हैं डिसिप्लिन की वो बहुत जरूरी है केवल हम रूल्स लागू कर देना ये डिसिप्लिन ना माने जब तक हम जो आपने अपने वक्तव्य में बात रखी कि टीन एजर्स के साथ हम किस तरीके से बात कर रहे हैं कैसे एनरोल हो रहे हैं उनके साथ मेंटली उनकी प्रॉब्लम्स को समझ रहे हैं तो जब हम उसको समझेंगे तो हम शायद डिसिप्लिन की एक्चुअल मीनिंग्स को भी समझने लगेंगे एकदम और आप बातचीत बहुत सही तरीके से आपने रखी और जो कुछ चीजें आपने बताई कि कैसे हम सीयूटी का फॉर्म भरने में ये का नीट का भरने में या उन्हें करियर काउंसलिंग देने में जो हम हेल्प आउट कर सकते हैं तो हम अपने स्कूल के अंदर पिछले दो सेशन से इस चीज को हम इम्प्लीमेंट कर रहे हैं बच्चों को बाकायदा वीकली टेस्ट में उस तरीके के टेस्ट देकर के तैयार कर रहे हैं उसका हमें थोड़ा फर्क भी दिखाई दे रहा है बस मैं आपको बता रहा हूँ मैं गुड़गांव में रहता हूँ यहाँ पे एक हरियाणा बेस्ड को स्कूल है मैं नाम नहीं देना चाहता बिकॉज ये सेशन मेरा रिकॉर्ड हो रहा है चार पांच ब्रांचेज मैंने उनको खुलते हुए देखी है पिछले दो तीन सालों में और उसमें बच्चे भरे पड़े भरे पड़े तो बच्चे आते हैं मैम बस क्यों वो ऐसा क्या कर रहे हैं स्कूल में कि उनके एक क्लास में सिक्सटी बच्चे हो जाते हैं फिर भी एडमिशन हो रहा है बच्चे पढ़ना चाहते हैं वहां पढ़ाया जा रहा है बिकॉज जब हम नीड को समझ अब बच्चा अगर अपने क्लास में दो बच्चों से बातें कर रहा है और हम उसे इनडिसिप्लिन कहते चुप रहो चुप रहो चुप रहो करते हैं तो वो तो फिर वो तो बच्चा स्कूल नहीं आएगा नहीं आएगा बिकॉज आप स्टाफ रूम में चार बच्चों के साथ बैठ के देखिए चार टीचर के साथ क्या आप चुप रहते हैं वैसे जैसा आप एक्सपेक्ट करते हैं क्लास में अंजलि मैम एकदम सही बात साथ जो एक मेजर प्रॉब्लम है जिसको शायद आज आपकी बात में एड्रेस नहीं किया गया जो हम लोग यहाँ नोट कर रहे हैं कि पहले आज हम बात कर रहे थे की नाइन्थ टेंथ के बाद जो बच्चे इलेवंथ में टेंथ उनकी कम हो रही है वो मूव ऑन हो रहे हैं जो कोचिंग सेंटर्स की तरफ या अकेडमी की तरफ लेकिन एक जो नई चीज हमें देखने को मिल रही है ये आफ्टर कोविड जो कोविड में बच्चे दो साल तीन साल घर रहे आ, कम गए एक तो वो थोड़ा उनको बैठ के हैबिट उस तरीके की पड़ गई दूसरा क्या कि अकेडमीज में बच्चे सिक्स सेवन स्टैंडर्ड से जाने लगे हैं जिसके अंदर उन्होंने एक तरीके से ये करा कि सुबह मॉर्निंग में सेवन ओ क्लॉक से इवनिंग फाइव ओ क्लॉक तक वो बच्चों को रख रहे हैं वो पढ़ा रहे हैं होमवर्क करा रहे हैं ट्यूशन है पेरेंट्स जो वर्किंग पेरेंट्स है बेसिकली खासतौर से वो 
वहां भेजना प्रीफर इसलिए कर रहे हैं क्योंकि उनके जो वर्किंग आवर्स है वो पूरे के पूरे बच्चे के वहां स्पेंड हो जाते हैं तो इसको भी मुझे लगता है कि एक आने वाली प्रॉब्लम के रूप में हमें देखना भी चाहिए और इसे एड्रेस भी करना चाहिए अब देखिए मैम अभी देखिए कितना कॉन्ट्राडिक्टिव दो चीज निकल कर रहा है एक टीचर ने आप में से कहा कि हमारे यहाँ छह घंटे आना होता है वहां पे तीन घंटे जाना होता है इसलिए बच्चा वहां जाता है हम छह घंटे नहीं आता ऑन द अदर हैंड आप कह रहे हैं कि हमारे यहाँ छह घंटे आना होता है वहां नौ घंटे जाना होता है या दस घंटे जाना होता है इसलिए बच्चा वहां जाता है हमारे यहाँ नहीं आता आप समझ रहे हैं तो दिस इज प्रॉब्लम आप प्रॉब्लम को समझने की कोशिश कीजिए प्रॉब्लम कुछ और है यही मैं बार बार कह रहा हूं प्रॉब्लम आपके यहां जितने घंटे आता है उतने घंटे में आप क्या दे पाते हैं और उनके यहां जितने घंटे आता है वो क्या दे पाते हैं जब तक आप सिंपल सी बात है बीस रुपए में आलू दो किलो जहां मिलेगा मैं वहां लूंगा इंस्टेड ऑफ दस रुपए में मुझे एक पाव आलू मिलेगा तो मैं नहीं लूंगा मैं तो कैलकुलेशन करूंगा कि हाँ जी बीस रुपए में दो किलो मिल रहा मैं तो वो वाला लूंगा ठीक है तो ऐसे ही होता है थैंक यू वेरी मच अंजलि मैम फॉर गिविंग योर सजेशंस एंड थैंक यू वेरी मच एवरीवन फॉर ज्वाइनिंग मैं बहुत अच्छा लगा और ये मैंने अपने रिसर्च के बेसिस पे निकाला मैं पिछले एक महीने में दसों स्कूल गया था अभी सर थे उनके स्कूल में अभी वीरेंद्र सर के स्कूल में भी गया था वेन ही वॉज इन इंद्रापुरम पब्लिक स्कूल तो मैंने पेरेंट्स से बात किया बच्चों से बात किया बहुत सारे स्कूलों में जाके तो देखा प्रॉब्लम और उसी के बेसिस पे मैं इस कंक्लूजन पे पहुंचा हूँ आई मे बी रॉन्ग आई मे बी रॉन्ग इन सम पॉइंट आई एम एक्सेप्टिंग दैट बट मुझे लगता है कि अगर हम इंट्रोस्पेक्ट करना शुरू करेंगे हम उसका सोल्यूशन अपनी तरफ से लाना शुरू करेंगे तो हम जल्दी रह पाएंगे इंस्टेड ऑफ कि हम एक्सपेक्ट करें कि गवर्नमेंट एक्शन लेगी सीबीएसई एक्शन लेगी कोचिंग सेंटर बंद हो जाएंगे ये हो जाएगा वो हो जाएगा मैं बता रहा हूं गुड़गांव में इसी साल इंडिया के बिगेस्ट कोचिंग सेंटर ने अपना स्कूल खोल दिया है प्रॉब्लम का सोल्यूशन मतलब प्रॉब्लम किसी और तरह से आपके पास आ जाएगी प्रॉब्लम तो आएगी तो उसे हमें सॉल्व करना है ठीक है थैंक यू वेरी मच एवरीवन थैंक यू फॉर जॉइनिंग टुडे थैंक यू थैंक यू वेरी मच थैंक यू